Hello and welcome to another video where today I'm going to be showing you how to make a laser gate. The one with beacons. Beacons. So first you will need to make the pair. It can't be more than two blocks wide. Well at least I can't make it three blocks wide. Well in Java you could because well Oh yeah, I've got one more thing. Well if you do that, and then you have that, to activate it, it's not activated. So, but if I do that, it is because it's like that. So I'm going to make it two blocks wide, like that, and then I'm going to make it like that. So first you will need to dig quite a, a large space underneath it so that all of this um, redstone all of the redstone can fit so I'm going to give myself a night vision potion and turn it to peaceful so then no phantoms will be up here so first you need to dig out, dig out, dig out a big, a kind of big place like this, and then you will need to get your beacon and build it like this to place these two beacons right there, and then you'll place those two like that. And then I will also make it like that. Then you need to get the sticky piston. If I removed one block, no wrong. Okay, well, you have to place the sticky piston there. Get redstone, get block, put the block there, and then you need to Okay, well, so what we would do is you would do it like that and then like that. And well, then you just need to link it up here with pose. And then you would place a block there and get a ladder back. Huh. Oh yeah. There. Okay, so that's shut. That's open. Okay, so then you just put cover it all up all of the redstone in your you'd cover it up and then just put some carpet over it so then no one can see it and now you've built yourself a working laser gate just beacons take very long to load well, go in. So I'm pretty sure that if you place a beacon, like, on it, it will just, yeah. But if you take away a block, it takes long for it to tell it that it's full. Basically, you would have to destroy the whole thing if you wanted all of this. 
and then you'd have to destroy the beacon and replace it so it would take long and well they won't be able to walk through it when it's got these the little beacon there and then when you open it wait and there. also the reason why i added the repeaters here it's because it would just make it so it way longer for the um, for the signal to pass and to, to do it um, to um, open it so then it's more like shut and then it would shut like wait that was instant Well, at least it's getting faster. So, you, I think you can place slabs on top of it. Yeah, you can place slabs like that. And decorate it, I guess. You could make it into a house and this could be like the entrance. And if you're wondering how it works, it's because it's a two block gap with fences there. And since you can't jump over fences, you can't get through it. So if you open it, you can. The, I'm pretty sure that if you do that, yeah, it's, you can just like make it floating on it so it doesn't it just doesn't um, you can't see it and it therefore looks like an invisible gate just do that and you walk through it you can add any colored glass there just like color it and you can also mix the colors I don't know what this would make. Okay, so that makes like a murky green. Look with that, it looks like that. Wait. If I just add this, like the whole rainbow, what would it look like? You can see the colours, pink, purple, blue, green, green, yellow, orange, red, white. That looks cool, but then it changes back, which is sad because it's pretty. I'm just going to add red and orange. And well, that's how you would make a working laser gate. I hope you all enjoyed this video and I'll see you all later. Bye!